I'm Spencer Wan. I am I'm the animation director of Castlevania. Today I basically gave a talk about how to control the animation in a, in a show that's being outsourced to another studio. So I brought a lot of the rough work we did, a lot of the key animation we did, and uh, even some of the storyboards we did that were tighter, uh, just to show people you know, the lengths we went to, to to make this show look as good as we possibly could. I, I was not expecting uh, that many people. I was not expecting people to actually applaud or anything, you know. You know, I, I, I try and just sit down and do what I do and I was so nervous and people have been like so welcoming and so patient with me because I don't speak Spanish. People have been having to drag me around everywhere and tell me what to do several times. <laughs> Powerhouse contacted me asking if I'd come and animate for them. My best piece of advice for someone who's trying to get into the animation industry is to learn how to check your ego and uh, do the work that people need you to do, not to go in and think, oh, well, my vision is clearly better than everyone else's and I'm this amazing artist. It's still a job and people are still going to be expecting things from you, so if you can't do the work, that they're asking you to do, you're gonna get laid off. Um, so yeah, definitely just being nice and respectful to people is a really good start. I see a lot of like younger students have these like big heads about their work and like what they want to do in, in the industry and you know that, that can put people off real easily so just like you know coming here and like talking to people just like being you know nice and human I feel like is a really great start at least. Technical advice. I would say try to be as versatile as possible. You know, like you're an animator, but you should try and learn how to do a lot of different things because sometimes, you know, there are animation jobs, but sometimes people want you to be a background artist, and if you don't know how to draw backgrounds, then you're kind of out of luck.